this, but I'm gonna raise you this. It's probably the greatest apology I've ever seen. I mean, <laughs> he, he, he didn't, he, he didn't, you know, he said I said it, but he's telling you why <laughs> I said it. I was low on insulin, I, I was hypoglycemic, and it just, oh man, I was out Look. of sorts. And quite, and quite frankly, if I'm low on sugars again, it might just happen again. <laughs> so I'm going to let y'all know. Exactly. This is why. In case I throw it out there again, here it go. This, oh, that was, that's the greatest. To be able to blame your bigotry on a disease is is incredible. I think he needs to, you know, be fired or whatever needs to happen. Needs to happen and needs to happen quickly. Mm. But that's my two cents, fellas. Love the show. Listen every week. Appreciate Glad you. I finally got the call. Oh, uh, this would be Uncle Nearest in a mason jar. The and good you, uncle. And you ask why in a mason jar? Here's the thing. I'm right. a I'm a throwback kind of guy. Uh no one asked, but I'm saying if you had asked why. Uh because I feel like Uncle Nearest, like if you know the story of Uncle Nearest, um a, a worker in the kitchen, might even been a slave. And he made up the mash, and Jack Daniels stole the recipe for the mash. Right? Mm -hmm. I'm pretty certain. That he, was the tester glass. That's the type of glass that he, right. was, <laughs> he was testing. Yep. Yeah. I'm sure he was like, wait, 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 wait. No, no, no. You got to do it. No, nah, no. Nah. Let's 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 okay. give Uncle Nearest a little bit more credit. Let's okay. say that they okay. was like, listen, Uncle Nearest, we okay. know we own you and all that, but we trust you with this recipe. So we're going to treat you with a little bit more dignity and respect. And Uncle Nearest is on whatever porch that he could sit on. Okay. And he's taste testing. He's not sneaking it. He's not sneaking it. You're not, oh, you're right. He's not sneaking it. He's not sneaking it. Let me let me get Costo. Hold on, I'll get Costo. Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Here we go. <laughs> this, <laughs> that you had that at the ready. <laughs> this is how talented we are. This is how talented we are. Here we go. Ready? All right, here we go. Wait, we're rolling. Sound. Check speed. Action. God damn. And cut. That's, cut. that's yep. it. Perfect. <laughs> Perfect. <laughs> he was like, I don't think it was like 60 something percent or 70 something percent, something like that. Seven and one shot, one deal. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I'm like, no, fam. You got two thirds chance of, of being protected. No, I'm, no, that's not, and not, not when they, my man down the street got a uh, 94 percent. Right. No, we going over here. I'll wait. I'll wait. I'll wait. Thanks. Is there is there anything? Let, let's pose this to everybody. Let me put the link in. Whoever wants to jump on the show, this type of show we do here. This is a live show. Don't trip. Uh, check the chat, the YouTube chat, for the link to join. And let me put up the number too. We take calls here too. It's a it's a it's a real situation. Uh, here's here's the number. Is is there anything that you would do with a two thirds guarantee? <laughs> Just, think about that. Down. Think about that for a second. Let's break it down. Let's break it down. Is, is so, any... uh, birth control. Okay. Right. Name. Pick your poison. Pick your pick your birth control. Yeah. And yeah. now they telling you it's only a a, a sixty six percent chance <laughs> that it's gonna be effective. Are you taking it? Are you taking it? I don't think so. Are you doing it? You're going skydiving. And they say, hey, <laughs> "Is it safe? You in the plane? Is it safe?" Yeah, right. it's safe. About two right. thirds safe. Slide the door, but <laughs> <laughs> what? When the John right. Johnson first dropped, they, they was on it like yeah, one people, shot. Those people's like one shot, and I'm like, mm -hmm. what? Well, first of all, what's what's really wrong with two shots? Like, is there? <laughs> that's my Christopher Walker. I say that's a great Christopher Walker, by the way. <laughs> I mean, if they're gonna go all out for the um, ball players, they're not gonna go all out for the guy who handles the ball. Yeah, the equipment manager is vulnerable in a bit. <laughs> yeah, then the crash happened. I lost everything. And I, oh. I, I lost a million dollars in real estate in one month. Oh, no, I missed that one. Almost anything could cause a stroke. Yeah. But, you know, for, for me, it was hypertension. My blood pressure was way too high. Life's diet, exercise, that's exercise, everything. Okay. Get a fat sack of shit, all that. Okay, all right, yeah. Women are actually, to me, I think women are funnier than men. But men don't want to hear the truth. The money shot was them coming out wearing Kente cloth scarves. 1994 called, and they want all that shit back. Shout out to Martha Stewart for doing whatever it is she's doing right here. Martha the Stallion. She looks good to be 94. So then the joke was, RuPaul's a smart individual. He did the commercial as both because he know women get paid less. 
They asked her when when police gonna stop killing unarmed black people. Let's see what she talking about. Alexa, when will the police stop killing unarmed black people? Hmm, I don't know that one. What? Not even not even Alexa knows. Wow. Nice cube, nice cube. Thank you so much for joining us. I said I never had lunch with the president. Thank you.